This is John Gearhart with Walsworth Yearbooks, and today I will demonstrate how online design can flip and mirror one template to create four separate designs. To take this design and flip and mirror it so that you can make four separate designs, there are some simple steps that we can take to make that happen. The first thing that we want to do is go ahead and select everything that's on the page. And then we want to group all of the objects together. This is important so that we can take note of the XY coordinates for the entire page. You need to write down the X coordinate and write down the Y coordinate. In this case, it'll be negative 51 and 6. I will show you how that will apply in just a moment. Now, to easier show what I'm going to do here, I'm going to go ahead and zoom out all the way to 25%. That way we can see all four designs easily. The first step will be to ungroup this. So object, ungroup. Next, we're going to go ahead and move this over here. That way it's easy to mirror it. So with this selected, go ahead and click Layout and you want to use mirror copy. Okay, so now we easily have created the second design. The next step is to copy this design and then paste that design. Okay, we're going to move this one right over here. And now we are going to group this one together, object group. And then we are going to flip it by 180 degrees. And now we need to ungroup it again. And now we need to flip and or we need to mirror copy it. Okay, and now you'll notice if we zoom in a little bit, you'll see that these bottom two are actually upside down. So all we need to do is highlight both of these while they're ungrouped and then switch it from 180 degrees back to zero. And now you'll notice that you've easily created one, two, three, four separate designs that are all based on the same template. What we need to do next is create four custom templates. So now that we have the designs, go ahead and, and move those off to the side And you want to group each one of these individually together. So object group. Object group. Okay, and you'll do that for all four of them. And then all you want to do is put this back on the page and if you use those coordinates that you took note of, which was negative 51 in this case, and 6, it has now put this template, this um, entire design, exactly where it's supposed to be. And you can do File, Save as Custom Template, and literally save this as whatever name that you would like. and then you can get rid of this one or just move it to the side. And then take your next design, and again, you want to come over here and type in the correct coordinates, negative 51 and 6, and now this design is exactly where it's supposed to be on the spread, and you can do File, Save as Custom Template. Save this one as a different name, and you'll want to do that for all four, and you'll be done.